spatial components have the same, but the time component has a minus sign. So basically, this one is covariant because it transforms in the same way, I guess, as the space time coordinate? Yeah, I, I, I actually don't really know uh, why, why they did the names like that. I, I, I don't know the history. Uh, because this one also transforms nicely with Lorentz transformations. And uh, this one, uh, we, that's the indices of the Lorentz transformations are up there. But that doesn't uh, uh, make much difference. Or no, no difference at all, I think. So, a tip to this one, you could say that this one is like the identity times a mu, or just a mu? No, 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 this, this is not the identity. Well, no, this I mean, the, uh, for this one, could you say that this is equal to a mu? This one is equal to what? Could you say this one is just equal to a mu? Like this. Yeah. Now, what do you mean by it? By, what, what do you write it down? What do you want it to be equal to? Uh, okay. So you uh, did say that uh, this one uh, keeps the time coordinate negative. Uh, and I guess that's a hint at using the metric. Oh, uh, no, not zero. Okay, no zero here. Uh, because the metric has this minus one in the upper left quarter, which means that when you multiply it by a vector that represents. Let me write it down. So if A mu is this vector, that is A mu of A. And these are three components. Then A mu with lower index. It's minus a zero a. Okay, that's all. Yeah, and, and this is equivalent to multiplying with that uh, metric in matrix. So the zero component changes sign. Okay, so okay. that essentially just makes the time coordinate negative. The, so the, the component, uh, you, you make it negative. The, the, the reason why you are doing this is is that if you look at the product, a mu, a mu, when you multiply, the rule is when you multiply and contract. This is making them equal to this. this is called contraction, as summing. And one is lower and the other is upper. And if you do that, if you multiply these two,